Hey YouTube, um, have you ever plugged in a device or maybe an Android phone and put it into the serial or diagonal mode and noticed that you got a, com a new COM port being assigned to it? And if you do this enough, you'll notice that you'll get, well, I've got up into the 30s in like under a week because sometimes you plug it into one USB and it gives you a COM port there, you plug it into another one, it assigns it one. I'm going to show you an example. Now, we go to devices and printers, and you'll notice that we got our USB composite device, and this is taking up COM number five. Well, I've got up to like 33 the other day, or 33 or 35. I don't want to exaggerate, but what do you do about that? How do you fix that? Well, it's pretty simple actually. You're gonna hit your command uh, run prompt. So hit the Windows flag key plus R. And you type reg edit dot exe. Hit yes. Now we're gonna go to H key local machine system current control set control. And then we're gonna go to com name arbiter. Click on a com name arbiter. You get these right here. So let's double click on com db. Now um, that's the COM port database, by the way. Now we're gonna get all these, and we're gonna hit the delete button so that it looks like four zeros. And I would usually hit OK, but I just did this recently, so I'm gonna hit cancel. But you hit OK, and then you reset your machine. If for some reason you get worried and scared about this, um, you want to back this up. Well, hit your export and pick the location. For instance, I've got com name export dot reg right here. Okay, you pick wherever you want. It'll save it. So if you don't like the results, you can just restore it. Okay, so that is it. Reset your machine, and you're good to go. All right.